good morning, magandang umaga, and welcome to today's episode of My PI Dream. Today is not going to be a regular Villa Feliz day, uh, because as you see over my shoulder here, and you probably hear coming down, it's a rainy, it's a rainy day. Uh, it's been raining all night, and I think we're going to get a slight break this afternoon in between two major fronts that's going through this part of the Philippines. Uh, last night, we had some torrential uh, wind and rainstorms that went through and uh, uh, we had to close up all the windows in the house here at Villa Feliz uh, because it was so crazy the amount of wind that was coming through. I thought, I actually thought we had a typhoon coming through and we are supposed to be having another front that's coming in after this one uh, within hours after the one that just went through last night uh, is about to slow down now and another one coming through and it looks like I think maybe it's like a monsoon or something like that. It's some type of tropical depression. Well anyway, that being what it is, I thought why not take the opportunity uh, to do some catch-up work before we left the house in the U.S. on our vacation over there. Uh, we connected back up with that company, uh, A Leader, who provided us with some shoes before where we did the product review on the wet shoes. Well, now uh, we have another surprise for you. If you are into those kind of product reviews, I need to close this out before we actually continue doing regular Villa Feliz episodes. So anyway, that's what today's episode is going to be about. It's going to be a product review. So sit back, relax, enjoy. We're going to do a time warp just a couple of days on our flight coming back over here. And we're going to do a product review on a pair of a liter shoes. <laughs> Magandang Hapon and welcome to today's episode of My PI Dream. I know we haven't been online for quite a while and the reason is uh, we're doing last minute we're preparation so for our trip back to the Philippines which is today. Yes. <laughs> we are, we're actually uh, about uh, an hour away from heading on out to the airport and catching our flight back to the Philippines and back to Villa Feliz and back back to our wonderful dogs that we miss so bad. Yeah. Uh, Hapo and Mary Ann, Mary Ann and uh, our family and friends. Uh, not necessarily in that order, but we miss everybody and we're anxious to get back. Now today's episode is not about our travel back to the Philippines, but it is kind of about our travel back yes. to the Philippines. Uh, <laughs> yeah. It's about something. We are going to do another product review today on our way back to the Philippines and we're going to use our flying experience uh, to test out uh, a product that we think you might be interested in if you do a lot of travel, especially in the air. Well, anyway, we're going to get today's episode started and we'll talk about what we are going to be testing here in just a little bit on our flight back to the Philippines. So without further delay, let's get today's video underway. really excited about coming home uh, to the Philippines. Today's episode is not specifically about the trip back to the Philippines, but it's a product review. We're doing a product review on uh, a pair of shoes. You remember we did a, uh, a video on some wet shoes, uh, I don't know, maybe a month or two ago, yeah. uh, from a company called A Leader, uh, specifically because we were interested in a diverse, very lightweight shoe to see if it would handle the, the activities that we do on a day-to-day -day basis. And it was great. We, we have had wonderful results with, with those shoes. And we got to thinking, you know what? We're getting ready to take how many hours? It's like 24, 26 hour flight. Yeah. One, of the, one of the long uh, legs of the flight is actually 14, 14 and a half hours. hours. That's the one from Atlanta to Incheon uh, in, in uh, Korea. And we got all the time, we usually take your shoes off inside the aircraft. They, sometimes they give you these little slippers. We just you have your socks on because it, your shoes are so uncomfortable wearing for that long period of a time just sitting there. And I got to thinking this, I said, we really need something that's really lightweight and something that's really comfortable. Some yeah. type of a slipper <laughs> that's not like a slipper, like a flip-flop that's all open, uh, but something that we can wear, wear from point of origin to the point of destination when we arrive at our house in Villa Feliz. So we got to thinking, you know what? A great company, which was a leader, that we used those shoes that they uh, sent to us and we tested them out and we were really happy with those. We said, let's give them another try. <laughs> so what I did was I contacted the company. I said, listen, we're getting ready to take a long trip. 
And we're in the market. We're getting ready to buy some shoes. We're looking for some really lightweight shoes. And you guys got like some of the lightest weight shoes out there. Uh, so the representative from a leader said, well, if you'd like to try another pair of shoes and you'd like to do another review, uh, go ahead. We'll go ahead and send you another pair. So Ness and I picked out something that's sort of a casual uh, wet shoe. It's really not wet. We're going to use it for regular uh, trolking tro tro through the airport and waiting in all those lines and you know the sitting down and everything like that but we want something that's comfortable and they have a knit shoe uh, that is extremely lightweight and it looks like regular uh, fashionable shoes so anyway uh, let's go ahead uh, to, and get started uh, what Aileen did they sent us a couple of pair of shoes right here and these are these are classic uh, knit fabric x range shoes uh, so Ness picked out a pair that she thought uh, she liked the colors, and I picked out a pair. So let's go ahead and open these up. We'll do a we'll do okay. an opening of the product. All right, these are the these are the ones that I picked out right here. Uh, I, I found oh, something cool. that would probably go with just about any type of jeans or or, or shorts, like what I'm wearing today. Look uh, at this. Ness wanted something a little bit with this kind of aqua color around on the outside and a gray color. So these are the ones she picked. So this is the female. Oh, look at this. It's uh, like a contour to the yeah, sole. Just, well, just like, just like the uh, other shoes that we had, the, the, the more that looked more like tennis shoes. So anyway, mm -hmm. this is the one that Ness picked out. And if you see, it's, it's all air underneath. It's got all the little pockets to allow airflow back and forth. <laughs> and uh, I, th I think what's really neat also is you see the little knitted uh, elastic right here. So I yeah. think this will be really comfortable. And for, how, how light is this? How, li how light would you say? Isn't this crazy how light this is? Oh. <laughs> well, anyway, uh, let's go ahead and try, the, let's go ahead and try these on. Uh, we'll go ahead and put these on. We'll show you what they look like. You see inside. And uh, on the inside, they also have the same type of sole on the inside that allows the air to go through between the cushion and a little honeycomb underneath the bottom. Well, anyway, we are gonna go ahead and try these on, make sure that they fit. Uh, we should have tried them on before minutes before we catch our Uber uh, that takes us to the airport. We'll try them on, see what they look like, and uh, this will be our uh, vehicle of transport on our feet uh, for this whole trip all the way back. And what we'll do is we will do a follow-on. When we end up back at Villa Feliz, uh, we'll do our final conclusion. Uh, is this an acceptable uh, type of a shoe uh, for long-term travel? So let's go ahead and try them on. Light, 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 very light, 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 like you are in a cloud. <laughs> like you're in a cloud. We'll be in a cloud later. <laughs> okay, well, we... <laughs> I airplane. I tell you, I'm a little biased for these shoes because I like the other ones so much, but I can tell you already, it's really like, it's almost like you don't even have <laughs> shoes on. It, it, you do feel, you feel like you're floating. So uh, the test or the proof is in the pudding, uh, which is going to be all these hours of flying, going through the airport, uh, sitting on a plane for 14 hours plus at a time. Uh, and then what we'll do is when we get back uh, to Villa Fleas, like I said, we'll do a wrap up on these shoes right here. So anyway, yeah, I think it's time to call the Uber. Uh, let's head to the airport. Okay. Let's get back home to the Philippines. <laughs>
I guess it's obvious we're back here in the Philippines because if you watch the video prior to this one right here, uh, you see we did a uh, an update. We did our latest Villa Feliz episode. Uh, but we're going to do our final conclusion uh, for this video as to our product review on the A-Leader uh, knit shoes, the knit wet shoes that we used on our trip from the U.S. to the Philippines. Now, I got to tell you, these are very lightweight. Uh, and. They, it's amazing, uh, especially Nessa's. Ness has the, I think that, I think that was the smallest size that they had, by the way. <laughs> yeah. And uh, when you when you do this, it feels, it literally it's feels like, like it's a like feather. It's like walking in the clouds. Yeah, it, it feels like a clouds. feather, uh, yeah. extremely. Uh, mine's a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger than hers, uh, and it has just a little bit more weight, obviously, because there is more content here. Uh, but even this one is extremely light. Yeah. Now, uh, the the review on these. Uh, we we wore these from the beginning of our flight. We had oh, about a 14-hour overseas flight, about, hmm. mm, what was it, maybe one hour from Charleston to Atlanta, and then about a four-hour flight, four-and-a-half-hour flight from Incheon, Seoul, yeah. Korea, uh, to Manila. So we wore these the whole time. I'm, 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 not, I, I'm not adding the numbers up, but it's less than 20 hours probably, okay. somewhere, somewhere around 20 hours, I guess. Uh, wore them the whole time, did not take them off the whole time. Normally, yeah. in the plane, what we normally put on the little yeah. slippers they give you, the international yeah. flight, we put the little this slippers on. This is very light uh, inside, the, inside the plane. And, and, it, and it's, it's, and it's like cool, and it's very cool. You don't have shoes at all. Yeah, you don't it's like have, slippers too. You don't have any heat, right? Yeah. You can't feel any heat inside because it's airy. And I, I want to show you the honeycomb on here, and it's identical to the wet shoes that we reviewed previously. But there is a sole inside, a very easy sole that's a easy to remove. You see the holes, you see the holes inside here, which <laughs> open up to the holes. Uh, maybe you could see me through the little honeycomb inside here. But combined together, they allow a lot of air flow to go through. These don't fall in, they're fitted perfectly. Mm -hmm. The inserts are fitted perfectly inside here. Yeah. And the shoe uh, is also on the outside, the knitted area on the outside is all air also. So you yeah. have air coming from the top, from the bottom. Airy. Very, very comfortable shoe, it, it, very lightweight. And, and this side here, it's like, when you, wear, when you wear them, they're like socks. They fit the ankles. That, that's right. <laughs> it, it's like, you know, if you wear regular tennis shoes, you normally wear those hidden socks that go on the inside where you don't really see the sock mm. but these they, they feel just like you're wearing those kind of socks and you don't need to wear socks with these type of shoes uh, and again they're very easy to clean uh, they're very you could uh, wash them in a, a little small tub these again the insert comes out very easy to clean and they dry very fast now we haven't washed these yet because we really haven't got them that dirty uh, we know we just use it mainly for our international flight so to conclude uh for the, the pros and the cons let's talk about pros and cons for these uh the pros are they're lightweight yes you can yes. wear many hours without yeah. any fat any foot fatigue and the cons does they don't have heels <laughs> Oh, the con. Oh, the, is that really? Is that really a, a con? Uh, okay. Uh, 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 is a leader gonna have to make a wet shoe that has a high heel on it? I don't think that's. I don't think no, that's their can, purpose. They can be like a, what they call that? Like a wedge. Women. Uh, you. Yeah. Okay. So anyway, the, uh, uh, as far as cons go, the. Uh, not really, not really any cons. I will say that the when you wear them, yeah. the sole on the inside, you can you can feel that there's an insert inside there. It's 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 not uncomfortable, but you can tell it's a little bit different from some of the very high expensive brand uh, type uh, shoes that you would have that are the lightweight shoes like and, this. And in this kind of weather, it's wet weather, you'll not have any uh, worries about wearing this outside. Well, of course, <laughs> like what's happening today at Villa Feliz here. As a matter of fact, we're right in the middle. Remember I said there's going to be about a, a two hour pause in between uh, the, the two different fronts that are coming through. So there's actually things I have to do real quick during this period. Well, anyway, to conclude, we're going to close this out. Uh, I'm going to have to say I give uh, two thumbs up for these. I don't, how about you? What do you think? 
Yes. Yeah, two thumbs up. Uh, again, another another home run hit by the company A Leader for these type of <laughs> shoes. The next thing I want to do, we're over here in the Philippines right now. I actually want to order another pair, but I want to order a pair for doing yard work, uh, something that you could take outside. And if you step in puddles and things like that, I, these I, I feel these are too nice to actually do. <laughs> yard, they're, they're too nice. These are the, I want to wear these like to the mall. <laughs> and uh, out to grab a bite to eat at a restaurant or something like that. Uh, but A Leader makes a bunch of different types of uh, shoes for all different types of environment. Rock climbing, uh, they do it for the beaches, uh, if you have a boat, uh, ma mainly because they're wet shoes. That's, that's their uh, primary objective is providing wet shoes uh, type of, uh, uh, of a product. Well, anyway, we are going to leave a link on today's uh, episode in the description block. Uh, the people from uh, A Leader told us that if you're interested and you use the link that we have on, you, know, you get a discount. I, I'm not sure. I'm not, I think it's a 10% discount mm -hmm. or something like that. So uh, if you're interested in the shoes like this, we'll go ahead and leave the link uh, and you can go ahead and make a purchase via that link as well. So anyway, uh, 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 we're really happy with these and uh, we're going to continue wearing these. We brought the other uh, pairs that we had from uh, our last review. We brought those over here as well. So we have uh, two sets of Aleta shoes that we're going to be wearing all around uh, the Philippines on our adventures that we have over uh, the next months to come. So anyway, that's it for today. I hope you enjoy today's episode uh, of the product review. Anytime we find something that we like, we're going to continue to share that with you as well. And again, remember, if it's a, uh, if, if we like things or we don't like, we're going to share the good, bad, and the ugly of everything. But there was really nothing but good on these shoes that we have here today. Again, we have upcoming videos that we are going to be doing uh, in the near future. We have some Balak Mine shipments that we sent over here with some uh, upgrades that we're going to be doing here to Villa Fleas. Please, if you're interested in uh, uh, things, DIY projects around your house, whether it be Anywhere you are around the world or here in the Philippines, please stand by for those videos as well. Uh, we will put a couple of links at the very end for a couple of our, uh, maybe the link to the previous A Leader uh, review that we did here as well, if you're interested in that review that we did back in Charleston, South Carolina. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for stopping by and watching today's video. I hope you <laughs> found it informative. Uh, if you did, please give us a thumbs up. Please share, and if you have not subscribed, just click on that little My PI Dream heart in the bottom right hand side <laughs> of your screen. You'll be subscribed and you'll be notified the next time we upload a new video. So until such time, you have a wonderful and blessed day. today's episode and you would like to see more just like these just click on one of the helpful links over to your right and you might be able to pick up on some good information on DIY projects how to or if you are interested in moving to the Philippines and building you'll find answers there as well